Hey guys and girls, welcome back to part 4 of Silver Parts Explained. This series uh, is all about teaching you the basic part names of sailboat. So if you're a beginner and you don't know what this is, stay tuned because we're gonna find out. And today's episode is about the sails and the mast. So I thought I put this, these two topics together because I already did a comprehensive video on all the different sail types. So I just wanted to give you a quick overview today of the different part names of sails and I'll take the mast in, I'll throw in the mast <laughs> for free because it's just, it's a short brief topic. So it's gonna be a short video. If you haven't checked out the overview video with the most important sailboat parts, I really recommend you checking that one out first. Um, actually the, the entire series is really cool for beginners, so make sure to go over and watch each video separately. But to quickly recap, we have four main segments, the hull in blue here, the, the mast in red, the sails in green and the rigging in orange. And there's a video on all of these, each of these segments. Today, the sails and the mast. So sails seem like a simple part of the boat, but they actually consist of many moving parts. <laughs> and the parts I, I gonna list, I'm gonna list today work for most modern sailboats, like 90%. There are some sort of specialty sails Go over to my uh, complete video on sail types to get to know them. So here's the overview. When we start off with sails, we first need to know the different sails. The main sail and the jib. And the main sail is the large rectangular sail in on most boats. And the jib is the head sail, the, the, the fore sail, also called the stay sail. And that's the rectangular sail in the front. So when we talk about sails, everything's got a different name. So when we talk about the different sides of a sail, it's not called the front or the back. It's, it's with all things nautical, right? It's we, we sailors invented a, a complicated name. <laughs> uh, so the different sides are called leech, which is simply the back side of the sail. Luff, the front side. Foot which is the lower side of the sail. And since most sails are rectangular nowadays, those were, those are it. But the corners also have different names. So the clue is the lower aft back corner of the main. So where the leech, the back side, the most downward part is connected to the foot, which is the most, the lower side, right? So where the foot and the leech me that's called the clue the tack is the lower front corner of the main so where the foot and the love meet and the head is the top corner of the sail where the leech and the love meet are you are you still following me <laughs> because i can barely keep up here no as you see it's it's not very difficult it's just name dropping i actually have a theory about this uh, i think there are a lot of sailing terms that come from the Dutch. I'm from Holland myself and I can tell you a lot of terms like starboard. It's in Dutch it's called stuurboard. I already mentioned this in the other in the whole video. And so my I think most of these terms are like a, a mix between different languages like the different seafaring nations of uh, bygone days. All right, let's move on. Some main sails also have battens, and battens are like sail reinforcers that run horizontally, and they flatten and stiffen the sail. And you can see them, they, they are inside the sail. Then we have telltales, and those are small strings, and you can use them to tell whether your sail trim is correct. And both your jib and main sail have telltales. So that's it, those are the sails. So let's move on to the mast, and this is a very short story. So the mast is the standing pole, it holds the sails. Sailboats can have multiple masts. Um, I did an entire video on sail rigs, and it really depends on the configuration, what, what 
type of sailboat you're, you're sailing and the amount and configuration of the masts is really important for this. But most sailboats only have one or two, well, only one mast, some have two. So for this video, I'm, I'm gonna stick to the Bermuda sloop here. And the mast, they all have a boom, which is a horizontal pole and it holds the mainsail in place. It's attached to the foot of the mainsail. And when you have a gaff rig, you also have a top spa, which is called the gaff. Um, and if you wanna know more about the gaff rig, I did a, a short video explaining that sail rig to you. So make sure to check that out. And that's that. Those were the sails and the mast. It's not that complicated. If you want to know more about sail, uh, sail types, I really recommend my in-depth guide. It's a long guide, but it's really worth it. It's one of my first videos, I, uh, I guess. Um, so let, let me know what you think of that. That was it. That was the entire series. We've uh, talked about the hull, about the sails, about the mast, and about the rigging. So I hope you enjoyed this series. I hope it was helpful. If it was, give, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. We're gonna do plenty of these kinds of exp explainer videos for beginner sailors and everybody, every subscriber counts. We're a new channel and we're really looking to grow the channel. So make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.